Justin Abdu, head women's wrestling coach at Simon Fraser University. Coach, your team's finally back in the national spotlight. What does it mean to have a team here, here, here for the first time since 2020? Oh, it's exciting for our girls. I mean, uh, sitting out for a year and a half, almost two years, was very difficult. Um, all the girls came back and stuck through this. And so being back in the national tournament is pretty exciting for us. It's a very special group of girls. We got five seniors on this team. Um, I started coaching the women five years ago, so they were my first group of girls. So it's kind of, it's exciting to watch them compete this weekend. They did a really good job, but it's really going to be sad to see them go. Can you give us a glimpse of what the season looked like without competition? Well, last year was very difficult for us. A lot of training and then we would get shut down for a bit trying to get creative with the training and so that we could meet the rules of COVID in our province. And then even this year, we knew we were going to be competing. We had two or three important tournaments canceled. We never got to see any of the East Coast teams. Um, so it was difficult to stay focused, but our girls, once again, a mature team, uh, really wonderful young ladies. They stayed sharp, they stayed focused, and they did a really good job this weekend too. Very proud of them. And you had mentioned that core group of seniors. You had them stay committed even without competition. What can you say about that group of leaders that really highlights who they are? Well, they're they're very committed to the sport of wrestling. They all they all really enjoy it and work hard. But more important than that, they're just they're exceptional students and exceptional people. Um, we're going to have minor rebuild coming up here, but we're lucky enough that these girls have really taken a leadership role with our young girls, and so I think we're going to. You know, we're going to have another nice group coming along eventually as well. Yeah, and you guys are sitting in third place right now before the finals. Um, what are some of the highlight performances that you've had today? Well, I think for, well, Lauren Mason's a four-time All-American for us. And I think one of the hardest things in wrestling to do is come back and get third when you're in a tournament where you're either expecting or wanting or hoping to win. And you lose and you have to come back. She came back and got third three times for us. So, uh... That's a gutsy performance. Um, obviously, Emily Q coming back to get third again today uh, after a disappointing loss yesterday. There, that was both. But we, we came with 11 girls. We have eight All-Americans. I'm proud of the way all 11 of our girls competed. Um, they competed to the very end. And I think we're probably about where we should be. I think those two teams at the top are very, very good teams. They're going to be hard to beat. All right, Coach Justin, thank you so yep. much. Thank you.